Won't you spare me over till another year? Hey guys, Risque here, and welcome back to Little Hope. Uh, so last we left off, some crazy shit went down. Um, but everybody's still alive, so I am happy about that. Um, so yeah, let's just jump right into it. Um, I'm scared. TBH. Um, I do want to check the bearing. Can I... Oh, shit. Wait. Okay, cool. I can check it. Okay, um... Deeper understanding. So, Angela was intrigued by her lookalike. She put trust in Andrew to help her off the shore. Angela narrowly escaped from the demon on the shore. Damn. Crazy. Okay. I'm still missing a lot of pictures. I don't like that. Phew! That was really quite close for Angela. She was almost lost to a fate worse than death. Not that there's anything particularly wrong with death. Well done! Not a soul lost so far. Things could have been quite different. Given the way in which the stakes have been elevated, some kind of weapon might be useful about now. Don't you think? You really should have explored more thoroughly, you know. Too late now. boys have some interesting theories. Maybe you're choosing to believe Daniel's theory, that they're already dead. My dream was lengthened after life. Oh, then began the tempest to my soul. I passed, methought, the melancholy flood with that sour ferryman, which poets write of unto the kingdom of perpetual night. <laughs> It's possible, I suppose. Maybe the bus driver can shed some light. This must be very confusing for you right now. Doppelgangers, witches, ghosts, death, and demons. What could possibly tie all of these souls together? I dare say we'll find out, hmm? I have been granted permission to give you a single hint. <laughs> okay then, we will once again turn to the Bard for some cryptic inspiration. I met him once, you know. I meet everybody once. Act 5, Scene 1, where Cleomenes begs Leontes to forgive himself for causing the death of Hermione. Do as the heavens have done. Forget your evil. With them, forgive yourself. Go on then. As terrifying as it might be, you should get back to it. I'm pissed that I missed a weapon somewhere. I bet it's in the fucking police station. Oh, that was just act one? Holy shit. Okay, so I read the most. She walked the furthest. So there's that. Oh, okay. All right. Angela's up. Wait! What in the name of holy fuck was that? I've never seen anything like it. It was like something from a nightmare. Did you see the way it looked? The gaping mouth, those dead soulless eyes? Whatever it was, it's gone now. I was nearly gone. If that thing had caught me, it was so close. You've had the crap scared out of you. We all have. But at least we got the fuck away from it. We did. Thank God we're all okay. Right now, we're safe. Sorry. Uh, Angela was glad that everyone made it off the shore safely. Cool beans. That thing, whatever the fuck it was, is still out there. 
could be hunting us as we speak. It was in chains. Just like the woman who went in the water. I don't believe that's coincidence. Either of you see what happened to Taylor and Daniel? They can't be far behind us. Let's just get out of here. Okay, so, you know, that was a thing. Find a route out of the graveyard. I will do my best. Hopefully we'll find a weapon of some sort. Uh-oh. Here lies a body of Isaac Worrell, aged 43 years, uh, died October 21st, 1702. Isaac, that's the one that killed Amy, right? I think his name was Isaac. Like, not the Reverend, obviously, that was behind it, but I think that's who the Reverend told to, like, throw her in the lake or whatever. Ah, oh, that's scary. Okay. Excuse me. Sorry, it's like, it's really late. You keep moving. I don't feel safe here. Yeah, you and me both, Queen. You and me both. Um, honestly, I don't know why I don't have my fairy lights on right now. I really should have them on. Okay, I'm just looking for all the sparklies. Trying to... Trying to figure everything out. All the places to end up. Let's get out of here. Okay, I'm not ready to go... Oh my god, John. I'm not ready to go there yet. Because that looks like the exit. I don't like the way John walks, it bothers me. <laughs> it's such a petty thing, but I'm just like, meh. Thomas. And his body of Thomas Wyman, department governor and magistrate, died July 30th, 1701. And of his wife, Mary Wyman, who departed this life Feb 1699. <sighs> Mary? Could it be the same Mary? I don't trust that kid. I don't fucking trust her. I don't trust her as far as I can throw her, and I have zero upper body strength. So, <laughs> there's that. Oh. What's this? Another tombstone. Abraham Alistair. Died February 13th, 1699. <laughs> Jesus, I'm so sorry. Because I'm not bored. I don't want you guys to think I'm, like, bored or anything. I'm very interested and invested, but, whew, it is late. Which, I mean, just adds to the spookiness of this game. I'm gonna have fucking nightmares. <laughs> I'm gonna have nightmares that some demon in chains is gonna come drag me to hell. Like, no thanks. It's not the way I choose to go out. How do I walk faster, for God's sake? L1. All right. I bet that door was locked, that gate that I didn't want to go through. What was this? Ah, okay. Interesting. Very interesting. Oh, Jesus, okay. Guess we're reading these. Oh, fuck. Tragedy to lose someone at that age. They're all in the same graveyard. So these people were in Little Hope. Oh my god. Megan R. Clark, uh, June 16th, 1960, January 16th, 1972. Treasured daughter and sister. Oh my god. So, oh, okay. I'm just, I'm losing it. Dennis, oh my god. Okay. I'm not going to look at the one with the flowers. I'm going to save that for last. Anne. Loving mother. And Tanya. James. Loving father. Or Tanya, excuse me. So then Anthony didn't die in the fire. Interesting, I thought he did. 
cherished daughter. Is this a impressed someone cares enough to still drop by this place? That creeps me out, honestly. <laughs> That's so weird. I honestly did not think that they were in Little Hope, but damn. I mean, I guess it makes sense. So in the first video when like Katrina was asking, oh, are we in Little Hope right now? I was wrong. We were in Little Hope at the time. That's crazy. I'm mind blown. Oh, okay. Well, this is it. Okay. I guess the gate is the exit. All right. Let's go. If it's locked, I'm shit out of luck. I don't have anywhere else to go. I mean, I don't think I do. I haven't seen any other gates. But it's like 11.30, so I could have easily missed something. Okay, it's all right. It's all good. Life is great. Although it is strange, I will agree. Uh, did you know there's going to be a Life is Strange 3? Let's stay away from that bridge. I'm all for putting as much distance between us and that hideous thing as we can. Pretty sure Daniel and Taylor would be thinking the same thing. Out of sight, quick! Then cycled away from the group as he emerged from the fog near the graveyard. Okay. Good to know. Andrew saw Vince right past on his break. Okay. Best to keep out of his way, I reckon. We should talk about what the woman said before they drowned her. The little girl has to be stopped. She was talking about stopping the witch trials, right? I'm not sure. Come on, let's go. I'll go in and take a look around. All right, come on, Daniel. That was the house from the intro, right? I'm scared. How you doing? I I'm wondering if that uh, thing could be coming after us. Don't think it's coming after us. What makes you so sure? You and me gotta stay real close now. So, now you're all soft eyes and smiles, huh? When you say close, how close exactly? This close? Okay, Taylor, relax. Maybe not that close. <sighs> like, bitch, now's not the fucking time. Jesus. There is a time and a place. Hold on. What's that? Nothing, probably. I heard something. Okay, that's just fog. Okay. Alright. I mean, I can't remember if I said this last time I recorded, but that really is a cool mechanic to, like, use as a border for a game. Just to have fog that takes you right back. Middle Hope Historical Trail. The Witch Trail. All right, cool. 
All right, where's some sparklies? I want to do some investigating. Some investigating, some edumacating. Oh, there's one. Okay. Quite so the tourist trail. We are here. Um, I have a feeling the church is going to be like the last place we go, because there's a lot of history at that church. Massacre Memorial. Okay. The museum. Are we going to the museum? I don't know. Is that where this leads? Hey, over here. You gotta check this out. That thing could still be around here. In the water. No, we left that thing way behind. We must have. Oh, shit. You're going first, right? You weigh half what I do. Better if you lead. I'm not crossing this crapped out bridge, no way. To find the others we got across. We got no choice. Fine. I'm heading across, you can follow me. Sorry. Taylor agreed to cross the footbridge to find the others, cool. If the bridge is still standing. Okay then. Okay. You go ahead. I'm just gonna stay back here and hope for the best. All right, see? Was that so hard? Can you stop whining about literally everything? What the hell is that? Fuck that. <laughs> no thanks. No thanks. That looks like a historical rock. I wonder if this tells about the historical rock. I do. Why not? Jesus. Do you see this? Okay, witch grave. This stone is believed to mark the burial place of the first person executed during the Little Hope Witch Trials. Yeesh. Let's get out of here. <gasps> Daniel! <gasps> get your hands off us! Oh, wait. I'll pick you. Mary? Mary? Mary! I am over this way! The fountain of all evil is here. What? What evil? You know what's going on here? We sure as hell don't. You scared us half to death. You speak to me of death. This day, I have pulled my wife's body from a watery grave and buried her in the ground with my own hands. And all this because of her. Mary. Who in the hell are you? Why do you look just like John? I have no answers for you. Perhaps I'm already under a witch's spell. There it lies. I found it. How did you come by this? Fashioned with my own hand. I take it to protect you. Suspicion and betrayal walk side by side in Little Oak. No one is safe. Good God. Okay, so that was the thing. All right, back as Angela. Nothing. No working phone, I don't know no sign of him? Nope, not yet. I just hope they're both okay. I figured we'd have found the bus driver by now. Wonder where he's at.
Why can't you leave us alone? I think she wants us to go after her. You want to follow her? She could be leading us into danger, even a trap. The two girls we've seen. One is from the past. This one is from here and now. Maybe the girl we're seeing here is somehow a mirror image of the girl from the 17th century. Don't you want to wait for Daniel and Taylor? If they were coming this way, they'd be here by now. Stay loose. Who knows what's up ahead? On that note, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, share this with your friends, hit the bell so you don't miss an upload, and I'll see you guys next time. Yeah.